is going on my fellow floppers and welcome back to my channel now today guys I have an awesome class set up for the MV4 especially for you Christmas noobs and people who are you know new to the game and stuff like that now just before we do carry on with this video if you haven't already guys go ahead and hit that subscribe button and don't forget to leave a like on today's video so in the background guys you will see that I have got a gameplay I finished 40 to 1 but I will cut it down so you can see like the best bits and stuff like that because this video won't be like 10 minutes long so anyway guys we're going into the attack first of all and the first attachment we're going to be using is quick draw quick draw is really essential for this weapon because once you're running around corners once you get into the enemy spawns and stuff like that it helps you get your iron sights up a lot quicker and also when people are running around the corners and stuff like that it really is useful now I really enjoy using this attachment because the iron sights normally go up really slow but with this attachment it kind of like doubles the speed of obviously the attachment I mean the weapon coming up uh, the iron sights and stuff like that so the second attachment we are going to be using is suppress so the reasons why we're using suppressor is keeps us off the minimap now this is absolutely brilliant especially when there's so many idiots on the game or even good people on the game looking at the map and especially those idiots who will just look at the map and they don't look at the screen to find out where the enemies are and stuff like that so obviously suppress keeps us off the minimap also it actually suppresses your weapon unlike some games like Black Ops 3 you can still hear the suppressor where it actually muffles your gun a hell of a lot and it doesn't actually make too much of a distance well difference should I say a, like minus five on your damage I think it is no you range sorry and that's all it does but otherwise it's not too bad so anyway the third and final attachment we are using is stock now stock is essential on all assault rifles some people like them on smgs i'm not a big fan of them on smgs but it makes you more mobile makes you be able to you know strafe side to side and when somebody's actually shooting at you and stuff like that it actually prevents you dying a little bit because if you're strafing side to side you're a lot of a harder target to actually be hit and stuff like that also it helps you like strafe around corners and through windows and stuff like that a lot easier it's just a lot easier to move when your iron sights are up so anyway guys we are not going to be using any secondary weapon lethal or tactical now the perks we are going to be running is perk one we are going to be using blind eye now blind eye basically keeps us you know running around the map it keeps us from getting the wardens and stuff like that from not killing us and the sentry guns and stuff and it keeps us invisible to all streets as far as I'm aware I don't think there's many that it doesn't keep us from I think it, there's only advanced UAV and the UAV and stuff like that it doesn't really make a big effect on so anyway guys that puts us on to the second perk for perk slot one that is ghost now ghost actually keeps the uav offers and it makes sure that we can't pop up on the screen obviously with the suppressor as well it really does help and it keeps us absolutely hidden and nobody can find us on the minimap so it makes it more sneaky and it's just a brilliant perk i've always used it on every single call of duty so we're going to look at perk slot 2 now we're going to be using scavenger but for people who can't actually unlock scavenger straight away i would suggest using momentum helps you get across the map quicker and stuff like that and get into those gunfights quicker however i would use scavenger because obviously i'm Ammo goes really really quickly in this game it does get really annoying so go ahead and get that put on unless obviously not like I said I think you've got to build something like level 37 to actually unlock scavenger so if that's the case then use momentum it's a good substitute perk for you to use so anyway guys finally we're looking at perk number three I'm currently running marksman but I didn't know which perk I prefer marksman or dead silence dead silence basically lets us sneak around the map and people didn't hear us which is really good for those game modes like team deathmatch and domination when you really want to sneak up into the enemy spawns it really does help a hell of a lot but marksman really just it helps reduce flame shits from longer range and stuff like that and it helps identify enemies a little bit better but it's totally up to you guys which one you'd like to use if you don't want to use any of them two i will suggest pinpoint that is another brilliant one so all those three perks for perk slot three it's up to you guys obviously which ones you want to use but those three are probably the most crucial ones that i would pick in perk slot three so anyway guys that is my best class setup video for the mv4 class setup so if you do enjoy today's video remember to leave a like and if you do use this class setup let me know in the comment section below also let me know what type of perks and you know attachments and stuff like that you do actually run on the mv4 yourself anyway guys remember to leave a like and subscribe to the channel but anyway guys as always i'll see you on the next one